Oh no, ah! Oh, my head does ache. Where am I? Well, we know where you are. Hello there. Bye. Oh god, have I got everyone to fucking join me? Join. Bye. God's sake. Join. Bye. Shamino, where have you gone? Oh, for fuck's sake. Seriously? You'd just abandon me that quickly, would you? Boys, I want you last. Shamino, you knob, where are you? Just gonna bugger off there, right? Join by Boyden. Your last scene here. Join by right. Uh, Hi, come on then. Right. Back to pistachio. I feel sorry for whoever gets the fucking raw egg. Anyway, food. So uh, you should just be missing. Yeah. <laughs> the end. <laughs> Old frigidazzi in here now. Yeah, that's still Hale and Hall Avatar. Join. No, but thank me for asking. Okay. Unshared. Blah, blah, blah. Search. Uh, we've done all this. What do you do? Speak of rarities. Okay. Till we meet again. Ah, oh, this is his house, isn't it? It's odd that he's a mundane and he's got a... Uh... Try the ale. Can I just see the how may be of service? Experiment. But of course, I must he's got a biblio for the answers. Oh, of course. You could have told me that. Beforehand, you're there. I'm interrupting your class. That's a voracious appetite for knowledge. What did I learn? Pistachio's experiment. Mm, I think that's just constant my crystal ball. Perhaps you can provide a clue to the matter of this missing brother. Since thou hast looked, once thou hast looked, come back and I shall divine what thou hast seen. The crystal ball. Oh, there. Uh, Graphically, into for telestorm. Tis so windy. Teleport storm. You trying to hide behind a little rock? Must hide. Oh no!
his brother's the fucking parrot. Tell Gustachio that Edrin, the missing brother, is actually ill the bird. You will know what to do from there. Ail is Edrin. Now he needs to take the bird Ail to the tower in the wilderness and place him where the lightning can strike him. Give thee this cage to hold the bird within. Return the tower with this new energy globe. Many thanks. <laughs> I got you. I've got to go all the way back up here now. She said she'd help me, didn't she? I smell something. There are some fish. I brought it for me. I'll just have a good fish. Okay, fair enough. Thank you, my lord. That would be kind. I knew a moment so I could call you friend. Uh, my little ones call you friend as well, as do their larger cousins. I'm a friend. Beneath the very ground on which I was walk, rest many twisting tunnels. They are known as the catcombs, and the lovely who call them home are the rat men. Uh, that was in that zoo area, wasn't it? I recognise you, my friend. I know. I'll give thee mine harp. Should thou ever find thyself in the complex below, strum it for them. A sweet tune from my instrument will pacify them. For in younger days, I did play it for them as they laid themselves down to sleep. Here, please take this for thy kindness. Okay. I've got a rat harp. No, I don't. Oh, okay. Just automatically stuck it in a bag. Even though I didn't ask it to. So, at some point I'm going into those catacombs then. Can we safely assume that? I think we can. Look out for serpent teeth and serpent ruins. Perhaps it requires some, yeah. Oh god, I've let ale out of the fucking birdcage. Get in. Door shut. Ale on a pedestal. Orb on there. Nope. What's happening anyway? Storm again. Should have brought a kite. <laughs> Whoa. I'm a man. I'm a man. I couldn't tell how miserable it is to be a bird. Just terrible mode. Well, I should say flying was rather exciting and all, but I never became accustomed to the worms. Run up for my dreams. I surely have lost my sanity, but now, thanks to thee, I have no want but to return to my flock. Of course, first I must locate passage aboard a ship. My name is Edrin. Indeed, my lord, I'm a shepherd. Can I take the sheep? I've never known another life. Well, except the time as a bird, of course. But like one of my own sheep lost in the wild, I long for a way to return home. Which is the most unusual thing I've ever known, well, say I've been a bird. When I would dream, I would envision this maiden, fair as a summer's day. She called herself Cyrenush. Often I would see her from afar. Bathing in a spring or basking in the sun. And other times we'd be together, swimming Gardening. Oh, yes, yeah, a good old gardening together. Walking. Oh, I beg their pardon, Lord, I did forget myself for a bit. Well, yes, after I find my brother, I return home. If possible, it would be much safer to travel by ship. Well, I suppose the ship would offer a little more protection, but anything would be better than travelling in the open, with the storms and all. The most unusual thunder and lightning I've ever seen before, but the suddenness in which their strike would be unbelievable had I not experienced one first hand. The storm had barely begun. A flash of lightning, clap of thunder, the next thing I know I was flapping wings instead of waving arms. Memory's weak after that, but I do remember hearing Kane's shouts. Kane's my brother, he's a few years my junior, but certainly an able shepherd, and uh, how worried he must have been while I was a parrot. I wonder how we react seeing me again, hoping he's not strayed too far from home. Well, we live on the mainland. Since I spy the mountains of freedom off in the distance, I know this is not the mainland, and I've seen little goblin activity. It's the forest near our farm. Our terrible number of goblins often come to raiders on the way to the city. I'm allowed to send our sheep south of Fawn. There's some grazing pastures there. 
Well, rarely set upon us, my lord, though sometimes a few will steal our sheep. Sometimes there are worse than wolves, I think, and much meaner. No, nothing in mountains of freedom, save they follow the coastline in an upside down U shape. There are no mountain ranges like that near my farm. Very they will. So what did the cage turn into? If he turned back into a parrot. Whoa! Then what did Cain? Sorry, Cain had the parrot. Eldrin, I think it was, wasn't it? You there. Uh, right. I don't know what to do with that stone out, whether to get rid of it or not. Welcome back. Eldrin's returned. Eldrin was ale. I mean, the stone trans uh, changed Eldrin into that parrot I found. All the time I searched for him and I had him right here with me. Then I'll tell you that one of the mages could help me. It was fucking me. I'll be going home soon after him finds the ship. Bye. Experiment. As complete the experiment as token appreciation is the mirror of truth. Okay. Thankly for that, now work has been completed. I have time to teach magic as I promise. I said in my experience, I'll teach these spells free of charge. Okay, first circle. Right. Bye. Cool. Uh, so the mirror of truth. Do you know? I should probably put these in here. Can't do anything with the mirror of truth. Crystal rose. Come of beauty. Who art thou, stranger? Why can't I see thee? Curse this imbalance which veils my mind. I think something is supposed to be overlaid on the screen, like when Arcadian popped up. So I'm missing spells here. Just a fan who stole my stockings from Torso's house in an attempt to blackmail the Rav Fair. Now he's returned to me, I've already seen to that. Shall, he shall die for what he tried to do to us. Uh, a sorcerer spell, blah, blah, by spells. No. Bye. Okay. Who else has got spells? Who are you? Yeah. So I already have fetch. Eight circle spell fetch. Yes. There's one more mage. Torisio. Oh, he's the. He's the automaton guy. Stefano, comment if they receive information. Stefano attempted to try a love by stealing her stockings from my manor house. Now dead, show his face again. I shall have him destroy. Glomer and I have already seen to that. Spy spells. Spy spells. I said guilds only. Shit. A false coin. One thousand sixty-seven gold coins. Nineteen guilders. Five hundred nine falari. Who's got all the money? A false coin. Four, five, 
it makes a stack of five. This spell is amazing. So, my spells, by spells, seventh circle, lightning, three hundred and fifty, hackle that bastard. My four hundred cause fear three hundred. Oh, I'll just fucking pay that. Oh, I've already got it. Betray. Do I already have that? Yeah. Six circle, but create automata, haggle. Hey, I'm gonna go very really low, are you? I'll do. No. Bye. Right. If we go back to the prison, grab a few of those bits of equipment that was left. Go away with that rotten egg. Oh, you're talking about the egg. I thought you were talking about him. What else is this? Oh, it's the rangers. We meet again. Bye. Who are you? Returned again. Did you actually buy anything from him? Where am I going here? So people are saying they need a way off the island, so let's go talk to Hawk again. <laughs> what can I do for you? Leave island. You still try to leave the island? Well, I don't want to mention it before, but there are caves in the southern mountains. Legend says they lead to a mainland. The mainland. You can find the right path. When only venture there, I've ever returned. I'll wait to the Julius of possession of a key that was at the end down there. Think twice of the with Eve for made such a journey. Well, how handy that she sat opposite you. Catcombs, so that's the land of the catcombs. So thou oh, thou hast not ventured into those ruins south of town, they're dangerous. Don't care what they're after, but I'll tell you that will throw thy work the way down there. The text below the other to the rat men. The depths belong to the rat men. Not to mention the burning heat, that's why the gate must always be locked. Ratmen. Too many ratmen to eliminate, so it's only my duty to see that the gate remains closed. All that I and other rangers can do for him pacifies soft scraps is through through the gate. Because my job is to keep any of those creatures from getting in the city. Might be able to forget that I saw anyone going down there if the price was good enough, but I doubt even though I survived the heat down there, the ratmen thrive on it. The temperatures down there would most certainly boil the iron on flesh. I don't want to ever venture into the catacombs with 20 strong rangers at my back and before we've gone too far, half our party had fallen to the heat alone. In fact, we were walking into a Smith's Forge. I turned back, no one have gone there since. I attempted to loan the key at a price, but not until I found a way to protect it from the fear temperatures. Giving the key now would mean certain death. would be foolhardy enough to venture. So I may protect it from the rat men, but only magic can save it from piercing some heat. Turns in his key, and has found the means to survive the heat. Heard that Magic to pet thyself in the heat in the catacombs. So that I was thought to take enough reagents, not that it will survive the ratmen. I will loan this key for say 40 guilders. It's worth that much now. That's the catacombs. Yes, well enough to take this blue key. We'll open the gate to the catacombs for thee. 
Great. That was easy. The only downside is I have no idea where they are, other than it said south. Cheese. It's randomly yelling cheese. I love it. Oh, rats. There's a good chance this is it then. doesn't work on the maybe it doesn't work on normal rats maybe it's only on rat men I don't know what I'm looking for in here aha I room room that is what I said a room ah a room I cannot remember which Pink Panther film that is. Whoa. Is that a fire elemental? Oh, we're off. Where are we going now? Fucking L2 fire elemental. to get into there. Hang on. Look, I've got this harp. Stairs. Sleep field. <sighs> Does this go to where the undead are? It's just the way that they just <laughs> sleep now. Bang. Remembered, uh, catacombs. Boyden said he's got an extreme fear of fire, hasn't he? Yeah. It doesn't seem to be showing. Oh, 
Well, the rat men aren't that difficult, aren't they? You have a sleep shaman, it'll be alright. Therefore, yes, no. 